Class 6, Tuesday, English. So, we're going to do a bit of planning today. Um, because I want you to write a recount tomorrow of the story. Okay, now, the interesting part of, of a recount is that you can write it in any perspective. So you could write it in a perspective, from the perspective of the lost thing, the boy, another character. And you can tweak and change it as much as you want. Okay, so the key thing is to watch the video again. I put eight maybe key parts, you can drop them down or draw them, it's up to you. Just like we've done in class, you know, you could do a little mind map. Um, the way you want to plan it is up to you, it's just you need points to remember. Um, and I'd use one per paragraph um, for your writing tomorrow. Okay, um, you can, like I said, draw and write about these things. Okay, now... What I also want to share with you is Ines and Annabelle's work from yesterday, as they were brilliant. So, Ines, this was my favourite part of your work. She wrote the words, no sign of joy. Just this bit here. No sign of joy or excitement seems to be lurking in the downstairs of the old rotten house. I love that. Lurking. What a great word to describe what's going on. Okay, great verb. You know, that is exactly what we're looking for in our writing. Choice of word. Now, this is Annabelle's. I'll read you the start. So, let's go from fresh breeze tickling your nose, the sand wriggling underneath your feet, squelching with every move, the roar of the kids having fun, swift, swifting through the air. Life was luxury there. It was boring, the same routine. I get shouted at by my strict parents. Everything I do backfires. I just don't feel like I belong there. I am different from everyone else in attitude. I have friends, but they're not loyal because they never liked me. Now, I'm going to hold it there. Now, what I love about Annabelle's is the contrast between the squelching and the tickling of the nose. You can see the excitement in the character and then you've got the sad part after uh, and the, the disappointment and the feeling of not being there. Okay, so wonderful work. Now have a go at your plans and then when we do the writing tomorrow, I'll share with you an example. If you send me some plans, then I will put them on the video for tomorrow. Okay, so take a photo, email them to me and I can use some of them for tomorrow. Okay, great work, guys. Take it easy.